Hey everyone, my name is Sister. Today I am going to be showing you guys a very useful slash weird slash random trick in Jailbreak that a lot of you guys may or may not know. It depends on um if you've played this game for a while or not. But I'm gonna go ahead and just be on a police team. I you know I changed my uh, character a little bit because um I can show you guys it a lot better with the unique bacon outfit than with my regular outfit. So um looks like a, a deformed bacon head, but I mean that's what's a unique bacon. So anyway. You can see right over here that I'm on the police team, and if, when I'm on a police team, you can see when I click these outfits, then you can see I become a, a unique um, bacon hair and cop, and I can become a SWAT bacon as well, and like wear these things, you know, like all of these things over here, you can wear them. And yeah, so like you might say, oh, it's just a com cosmetic thing, but a while back, like I think last year, whenever um, I first started Jailbreak, I used to um, just dress up as a, a police officer while I played Criminal. If you guys were subscribed like back then in like a June, July 2017, this is 2018 right now, so, like you'd remember. I started off playing as a police and I quickly discovered that if I dressed up as like, a prisoner suit as a police officer then I could actually like fool some people and get them into thinking that I was a legit prisoner. So I'm gonna show you guys here how to become a prisoner while you are a police officer. So right now you guys can see my uh, chrome window over here you can see this is my Roblox page and I managed to find an exact copy of the um Jailbreak prisoner outfit over here. I'm gonna go ahead and just uh, show you over here. I'm loading into my alt. Yeah, you can see it has like the uh, orange jumpsuit, and there's really like no way in game, like, because I showed you guys in the earlier Mythbusters that if you click the uh, change out of prisoner suit, it'll remove all the additional in game clothing. It'll just take you back to your Roblox avatar. So you can't really wear the prisoner suit. So let's go real quick and just come right over here. So I, this is my group over here. If you wanna come, to my group, I managed to um, just upload it to my group just so that it's easier for everyone to find. And these are like all the shirts you guys can get in the um, group. And what you guys want to do is just come over here to my uh, group. I'll give you the uh, link in the uh, description or pinned comments down below. Ignore all these scammer bots over here. But basically, I managed to find the exact copy of the Jailbreak shirt. And if I come over here and just uh, go on my avatar and just go to my uh, clothing and go to my uh, shirts and find my um, uh, prisoner inmate top over here just like this. And yeah, so you can see right here I'm wearing my uh, prisoner suit. So you can see like right now I can just go into 3D mode and you can see this is basically the exact copy of the jailbreak suit. The jailbreak suits look a lot more orange because of the uh, lighting conditions in the server. And also the same thing with the um, uh, jailbreak pants. If I go over here and just go grab wherever my inmate pants are, there we go. Those are the same inmate pants I uploaded to my uh, group. So you can see right over here we have all of these um, inmate suit now. I'm gonna go ahead and just come back over here. I'll switch over to become a police officer once again. And it's gonna take a while to load. I don't know why the jailbreak server or something to do this. But you can see right over here that we are basically the exact same color as the uh, alt now. So if I come over here and just do a, a comparison, ignore the fact that I am a ninja because I had unique bacon whenever you could use ninja to no clip through the wall. Yeah, so you can see right over here that these two suits are literally identical except for the fact that I put a giant horse L on the front of that shirt over there. But yeah, so this is how you can like become a, a police officer and like look like a, a prisoner, just like maybe a prank some people, make some people a little bit confused. And yeah, just like throw some people off, make some people salty, especially like Creek. So if you saw me earlier, if I go over here to a police station, you see that police officers, because I do have the SWAT game pass as well, I can dress up as the um, police uniform. Like, just perfectly fine, like, it's because I'm a police officer, it's, like, expected, and you can see I become a police officer. But what happens if I come over here and switch over to a prisoner? So I'm gonna go ahead real quick and just come right over here, my alt is gonna be over there opening up the door. You can see, whenever I click on these, um, police items, it doesn't work. And you're like, why doesn't it work? And probably fairly obvious, because I'm not a police officer. Well then, I have a little trick up my sleeve as well. I'm gonna go ahead and come back over here, and not only do I have the prisoner suit on Roblox, what you need is just to go to my group again, and you find the jailbreak police top over here, just like this. And I'll link all these in the uh, description down below, so you guys can uh, be sure to go uh, grab it. And right over here, jailbreak police pants. And now you can see, basically, that I am a jailbreak police officer. Now, if you look closely over here at my alt, you can see that police officers in jailbreak have a badge right over here. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the uh, badge over here. Let's go ahead and go to um, uh, front, I believe is where it is. And it's just the uh, RBI Special Agent badge. And now I'm going to go ahead real quick and just uh, switch team over here. So like, I am going to have to escape. You can see for a split second there that I actually look like a police officer. So here we go. I have myself a, a key card. And I'm just going to go ahead and just drive over to the criminal base over here in the mountain or the city. It doesn't really matter which one it is. I'll go to this one over here since it's much closer. But if you go to a criminal base, and I'm not sure exactly how long this was in the uh, game. You could go to the uh, change out of prisoner jumpsuit over here. It also works for police officers removing their police clothes in case they want accidentally 
accidentally grabbed some and wanted to like become a, a fake prisoner or something like that, then you can go ahead and just come to this area by the exit. And then if you click this, you can see I look fairly legit. I mean, as long as I'm not in the vehicle, because if you are in the vehicle, you get that red name tag. And I mean, as long as I stand over here, then I look fairly legit. Like, I look like a legit cop from far away. People wouldn't really think that I was a prisoner, unless they were close enough to, like, look at my name and see it was red or orange. But yeah, so this is actually a pretty good trick for fooling, like, especially, um, noob players or younger players that, like, tend to judge people more on their looks instead of their name tag. So if I do this right, then I'm pretty sure that if you get arrested, over here by like my alt, I'm gonna say like is uh, some other police officer. But if you arrest yourself like this, I'm gonna go ahead now and immediately switch team to uh, become a, a police officer, uh, just like this. And um, I'm not sure if it actually worked. Okay, I think it did. So here's the thing. I basically just team switch while it was about to teleport me to the prison cell to become arrested. And because, like, in the process of doing that, it lose everything. But for some reason, I don't know why Bad CC did this. You don't lose the handcuffs and the taser. So you can see right over here, I still have my handcuffs and I still have my tasers. So I'm gonna go ahead and just come over here to my alt real quick and just uh, grab a, a key card real quick so I can actually escape. And you can see the second I grab something new, the game switches the color of my hotbar to orange to uh, show me that I am on the prisoner team. Police officers have um, blue circles around here. So now I have a key card. I'm going to go ahead and just do the exact same thing and go to the uh, criminal base. I'm going to go ahead and just click this. And now I'm going to take out my handcuffs. You can see I look even more legit like a police officer. Like, I don't think anybody really, like, unless they're super skilled and actually look at my, my uh, name from close up. And you can see right over here, I look fairly legit. I even got a taser, but sadly this taser doesn't really work. But, I mean, I can act like a police officer, you know? I mean, I still have my, um, my uh, badge here. That's really weird, man. Because I kind of glitched myself a badge as well. I mean, I look completely legit. Besides the fact that I actually can't use any of these weapons, I could probably just like pop on in front of a jewelry store in a public server as a criminal, with my handcuffs out, and maybe some police officer just comes over here and like, oh, this guy's camping. And then I go inside and start robbing, and he probably goes like super confused, and maybe he called me a hacker. But I mean, it's pretty cool just to like dress up as the opposite team to deceive people. If you don't have the uh, SWAT game pass and you try to dress up as a, a SWAT officer with the uh, SWAT uniform and everything like that, then it's not really gonna let you do that because it'll give you the uh, game pass dialogue. So if you want to become a SWAT officer, I managed to also find the uh, jailbreak SWAT suit. So let me go ahead real quick and just come right over here. Where is it? Possibly, uh, it's right here. Jailbreak SWAT suit over there and jailbreak SWAT pants right over here just like this. And uh, yeah, so you can see right over here while my character loads, now I look like a unique SWAT officer. And if I load into the game, it's going to basically do the exact same thing. No need to show you guys uh, several times about how that exactly works. I'm also going to attempt to uh, locate all the uh, gear on the uh, police wall, like some of the hats and masks, face covers, whatever the heck those things are. Just in case you guys want to go all out like looking as a uh, police officer. I like to dress up as a bacon here because looks don't matter. And I play jailbreak looks don't matter stuff, but... The majority of the Roblox like community judges people by their looks. And if you can't be a police officer and play as a criminal, then I guess it could like deceive like some of those people. So yeah, you can see this is the uh, police hat. These are the SWAT things. I'm going to go ahead and just come over here to the Roblox catalog. And I'm going to go ahead and just do all categories and search a uh, police hat. And I'm pretty sure that if I set this to uh, accessories only, I'm going to go ahead and just uh, change my uh, search term to police only. And you can see this is the uh, actual police hat. I don't really have one. You know what? I'm just going to buy one. Screw it. I want to be a fake police officer. And sadly, it is in fact limited. So you're going to have to waste a lot of Robux doing this. But yeah, like you can see right over here, I'm going to go ahead and wear the uh, police suit instead of the um, SWAT suit over here. And while my character loads in, you can see I look fairly amazing with this um, uh, suit on. So now I'm going to go ahead and just go back to the catalog and show you guys the uh, SWAT ones as well. So back to uh, accessories over here. You can see this looks like a uh, ski mask over here. So I'm going to go ahead and just search um, ski mask, I believe. Okay, I'm pretty sure I have found it. So you can see this one, I believe the uh, jailbreak guys have retextured this one over here. So this looks very, very similar. You can see the uh, mesh is basically the exact same as this, but I'm a criminal right now. I can't really show you. So I'm pretty sure that if you want to um, get this uh, Ninja Mask of Shadows right here, it's the exact same one as this um, thingamajig on the uh, SWAT team. There's also like a uh, helmet with um, goggles on it. So I found a, a helmet over here called uh, the uh, Police Riot Helmet. 
but I'm not really sure if it's the uh, right one. I'm gonna narrow it down to a police helmet. I'm not sure if it's gonna give me that uh, jailbreak one. It could potentially be this one over here. But um, you can see it's a little bit different. I think Jailbreak retextured it completely. Pretty sure it's a, a different one. So I wasn't able to uh, find the uh, SWAT helmet over there. But for most people, I believe, you don't really need the hats. As long as your um, clothing looks like a police officer, it should be able to um, distract enough from uh, most of the uh, police officers. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and from now on, maybe like just wear a, a police suit. This way I can um, just go around and like uh, show people that I'm a police officer, or at least pretend to be a police officer, and you could do that uh, team switch glitch over there every time you just like, someone arrests me in a server, and then right when you're um, about to get arrested, switch over to police officer, and then you can get yourself a free set of handcuffs over here, just like this. And also a free taser as well, in case you just want to like, prove to someone, hey, I'm legit, I'm a real police officer. I'm pretty sure that whenever I get arrested, I don't lose my ability to you like, use your handcuffs. So I'm going to go ahead and just come back over here on my alt account real quick. I'm not sure if you guys can see, but uh, here we go. Uh, let's go ahead and just show you right over here. I'm going to go ahead and just arrest my main account just like this. You can still see that I have my handcuffs and taser. They just don't go away for some whatever reason. I have no idea why. Ask BetCC about that. Pretty sure because he assumed that it was a police only item that there was no need to take it away. I still have my handcuffs and tasers. So I'm pretty sure as long as I go oof. I'm not even sure if that going oof would actually work. So basically, as long as I don't go oof, you can see right over there that the stuff is now gone. Then I should be fine. And I'm wearing the uh, police hat over here. Look really weird on a, a unique bacon hair. As long as you don't go oof, then you should be good with the handcuffs forever. But if you guys enjoyed this, some uh, quick how to become a, a jailbreak police officer, wear the jailbreak police clothes without being on a police team, be sure to press like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.